Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video on my channel. Today we're going to do another KDMO update, but sadly as you can see here on the screen and as I'm going to show you uh, separately again, I lost my PC yesterday. This is why I'm apparently playing on a virtual machine. I don't know why I'm having this back now, but apparently my PC is not real. Yeah, my PC is not real. I lost it. Would be nice if you help me affording a new PC. Donation link will be in the description. Together with a new microphone arm and a new hard drive, which actually died recently. Yeah, my, my microphone arm broke once more and I can't put it together anymore and one of my hard drives died. So minus two terabyte of space. Cool. If you want to help, feel free. Otherwise, just subscribe to the channel so we can maybe reach 1k um, one day again. That would be nice. And I would say since I can't play the game, we're just gonna go to the update notice on the website, which many of you still can't access because of the VPN thing. And we're just gonna go there and find out what's new. Uh, I'm on a promotion notice and we're gonna go to the uh, update instead. I don't know why it kind of looks weird on the screen, but hey, it's okay. And sorry if I'm, uh, if I'm sounding weird, it's also because of the microphone situation. I'm not having my... Um, yeah, my stuff built up. I just have this little uh, table stand and I can move it around a bit and it makes noises when I do that. I'm, uh, I'm sorry. Anyway, uh, that's, that's just standard. I hope one day I will have a number one. Would be nice. Um, anyway, new update. Like you can see, number one is a Digimon Rural... <laughs> It's a Digimon rebalance for Jarkusus and X Antibody Jarkusus, so Jarkus X and we will be able to check this one out by just click uh, clicking by just clicking this link. I already did that. I have it open here, and what you will see already is that we have a triple S Jarkus, and I don't think it will be um I don't think it will be Z, and the stats more look like um O X. So. I assume this one is Omega Mon X, and that means that from 4,255 basic attack, we're going to go up to 4,816. I hope it's 16 basic attack, which is even more, and OX is even stronger now. I mean, not that a triple S you have to pay hundreds of dollars for is strong enough. No, no, it's a bit stronger now, and I think that's actually a good move. Yeah, people who played hundred, uh, who paid hundreds of thousands of dollars, should definitely be uh, overpowered as fuck. Thanks, Cash Games. I'm definitely a fan of your choices. Same with the skills and some other stuff. Of course, some other Digimon are also going to get buffed. I guess Triple S is AOX. And it keeps its attack. <laughs> Wait, what? Does it actually keep its stat? Nice. Is this Alphamon Oreo Connects? I guess it is. And it keeps the stats. But Ultra Omega Cashmon. It's actually rising by 600 and 600 is actually a super high attack value especially since cloning the cloning attack is 1.44 times the original one like um, you're getting 44% plus or you, you get yeah you get you, as bonus yeah if you have um, uh, if you have 4,000 basic attack, you get four. You get another 4k, and then you get 44% more. Just as basic attack. This is this is uh just as basic attack. Just as cloning bonus. This is actually insane. And I'm so glad they do that, right? And we also have more HP. This is this is already the first thing that was great on this event, right? We have some fair rebalances. Definitely not only for cash stuff. I mean, obviously we already had the other rebalance, but I can tell that the fairest thing is on the lowest percentage and this is great. This is great. It's not that the game only rewards hardcore caches. No, it's fair for everyone. You have a fair 0.1% chance on every Omega Mon X anybody to get the beta. You still have to quest them on for the alpha, but you can get the beta with 0.1% uh, percent chance. And the only thing you have to do is simply pay $10 to get a box. This is all you have to do. So. Go work for a month, maybe earn $400, and you can already buy 40 boxes. And with a chance of 0.1%, 0 0 you can uh, get this get this, uh, get this, item. This is awesome. Great. <sighs> awesome. Great. Let's keep going.
So we have this rebalance and this is great. Then we have new riding items for Duke Bon X and Omega Mon X. This is actually okay. Uh, and then we have some nice events which I'm definitely interested in. That's why I'm going to read them all out. And what I can tell you here is that we have... Uh, wait, what is that? Wait, do we have a level dungeon? Invisible future NPC. <laughs> okay. Is this actually an XP dungeon? Which would be nice. Actually. Okay. If it is what I think it is, then cool. If not, then flip yourself. Uh, but it actually looks good. And you can drop stuff here. Okay. Interesting. I need to admit I'm not that, <laughs> I'm not, <laughs> I'm not as uninterested as I thought I would be, but okay, good. <laughs> Let's see what we have here. Mini exchanging things. Uh, do we have something interesting here? It doesn't seem like that. We have some 4 to 5 packs, which are decent. We have some incubating disc 5, so, uh, do 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 do. Uh, hatch back up this level 5, okay. Mm -hmm. Strengthening package. Uh, buff package, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Rare driven Digimon L5 step maturity. I don't know what that means, but I guess it's another level 5. Maybe it's Ramon, but I don't think so. But we have some 4 to 5 eggs anyway. Okay. Private Endless Work. We have some interesting rewards. For example, amplification boost of 300% for doing something I'm totally interested in. Let's fucking go. Okay, the other thing is also interesting. We get 500% boosters and Fruit of Egg Drazuya, which are all character bound, by the way. Don't forget about that. It's awesome. Otherwise, it would definitely ruin the economy. That's why I'm that's I'm super happy that they're doing this because if you if you give that if you give these items and thousands of items over years to players and they can't trade them, then they save the economy because they will never be able to give it to someone else and get their money for it. So, people who are going to play the game just to sell items will be totally fucked because the economy is great and they will never change that. <sighs> great. So the next thing is we can get random monster cards, random less data box, random buff books, random intermediate data box and incubation discs which are, not, uh, which are not tradable for doing something I'm definitely interested in. Keep in mind that I totally play this game a lot and I'm glad we have so many events. It's not like I'm playing a mobile game in World of Warcraft instead. I'm actually playing this game 24-7 if I'm not on a virtual machine. I have a lot of fun in all the dungeons and I love this game and I pay a lot because I have a straight income. I have a straight income. I have a steady? Is it steady income? I don't know. I have I have a bit of income every month because I have a YouTube channel where I'm doing game O videos and Move Games would never close that channel promoting their game for years. Um, that's why I'm glad they do what they do. Uh, where was I? Ah, yeah, next thing. Um, there we have more events and there are more events and you can also stay logged in for event stuff like of of suffering of endurance two years ticket one dogs or random stone box two dogs you get a lot of dogs there so if you ever wanted to have a dog there you get one then also we have game modification and supplementary work what is there uh okay they changed icons Cool. This is definitely quality work. I'm glad you're doing that. Okay, is there something else in any events? Uh, no. Then we go to the interesting part of the add-on. Uh, the add-on, the update. We go into the cash shop because there's where the magic plays. Or where the magic comes to, to, um, to hand. I don't know. You know what I mean. We can buy stuff. We can buy riding items for 2,401. So 2,400 wins. Yeah, that's the... That's the other form of that. You need 2,400 wins in PvP, which we have since years. We're definitely not waiting for it. And you can buy um, level 5 DigiX. Rain? I hope these are DigiX. You can get them for 9,800 wins in PvP uh, each. And you get free fortune cookies. You don't get a fortune cookie here. That's kind of sad, so better buy that one. Better spend 9,800 wins instead of 2,400 wins. Because you know, PvP is something that is always fun in DMO. So better get your 10,000 wins right now. And then buy these cool items. Then we have more. We have skill memory cubes. Which you can buy for 
2,400 wins, 12,000 wins, or 24,000 wins, depending on the dogs you want. Yeah, the amount of dogs. Oh wait, here we have only pieces, so sadly no dogs for us. Uh, we can buy the homeostasis fruit in three different uh, things, and there is someone live. Cool. Um, da -da 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 -da. Oh no, it's actually something else. We have homeostasis fruit. Homeostasis fruit. We have fruit of the call meostasis, and we have fruit of the call meostasis ten ten. It is the same thing. <laughs> it is the same thing. It's just they just say differently here for some reason. All right, okay, cool. Then we're back. Uh, so why have a dress set of the equipment? Okay, so if you ever if you ever took your equipment and you thought you couldn't survive it, then buy a survivor dress of the equipment. A uh, survivor dress set of the equipment because then you will always survive your equipment. The only thing you have to do is to pay 9,900 wins in PvP and you get a fortune cookie. You get one fortune cookie. You can also see the components. You have a packaged survival helmet. It's also packaged, so don't worry, no one touched it before. It's packaged. The package identification tag. What? Okay, so. You get a helmet which is packaged and if you don't know where the package is coming from you get also a package identification tag. This is cool. Uh, on the package it is a pattern military, sturdy little on. You have also some effects and there's more. Great. So not open package limited sales. So I guess we're talking about openers. No, it's in general just a package. We get one mercenary expansion. We get five Digimon Stories expansion. We get one back expansion and we get one warehouse expansion. Oh no, we get 20 of them. We get 20 warehouse expansions plus 1, 20 bag expansions, 5 digital storage expansions, and 1 mercenary. For only 2,900 K KRW? Is this crown? Are we away from PvP wins to crown? In a really weird way to say it? What is KRW? Huh. Maybe it's... No, that's, that's, uh, hmm. Maybe it's Korean Worlds. Korean World Championship wins. I don't know. I have no idea what they're talking about here. But we also have a Duke Mon, uh, drive mode. <laughs> Duke Mon drive mode. This is sort of expression process. Uh, it could be that this is the animation changer. Animation changer for, uh, Gallant Mon Ace, which everyone has because it's useful and not expensive. Um, okay, good. Then I would say we are done with the cash shop, and I guess we are also done with this great update. I don't know if we maybe have, oh yeah, we have this little, um, uh, let me see, do we have, uh, am I blocking the website? <laughs> Wait, I'm not blocking it, do I? Okay, yeah, we have this lucky box, this is not where I wanted to go. Ah yeah, this is what I wanted to see. We have this cool update map, which we forgot about, uh, in this, in this, uh, in this video, and here we have it. Event number one, event number two, event number three, and event number four. If this is not great, I don't know what it would be, right? You even have this cool smiley and you have these calculations or whatever is down here. There you have something else. It's probably math. I don't know. It's something. And there is something with Go. So Digimon Masters will be soon uh, available as a mobile version like Pokemon Go. Just in Digimon. It will be great. It will be cash only, but this is fine. This is super cool probably, right? And yeah, more and more signs here. Anyway, we are done. I wanted to make this video as compact as possible, but I need to admit I had more fun memeing around this update than usual. Let's be honest, this update is as many early updates. We have a new dungeon, which is cool. We have many things in the cash shop, which is ultra amazing. And events. Events. You won't play them. I won't play them. We see us in GDMO. Have a good day. Leave a like. See you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>